Hey, we outside today. Is that how the song go? Cha cha cha. So today is Saturday, of course, because I only go places on Saturdays and Sundays. Well, I go places throughout the week, but Monday through Friday, I am working. I'm at home and I'm working. I'm stuck behind a desk for about eight to 10 hours for work. But today is Saturday and you know what that means. Me and the family are heading out. We have to run a few errands today. As you can see this morning, we went on our family walk, guys, and it was so, it was so beautiful because the weather is changing. It is fall now, guys. Oh, yay! <laughs> no, but it's fall season, and I love fall season, so... Um, when we took our walk this morning, I was looking at all the trees, at the leaves, and it's definitely giving autumn, guys. It's giving fall. So we did our morning walk today. We walked to Luffy. I stretched. I went to my cycle class this morning. Um, I just wanted to get a full body workout today. So your girl haven't been working out for real. I just started back getting in my groove with working out. I just started going back to my classes too, Zumba, cycle bar, yoga, Pilates, all those great things I am starting that back up so it's important for me to stretch because my body ain't there yet it's not there yet y'all it's not giving workout girl it's not giving a girl that goes to the gym or works out a lot it's not giving that yet but I'm getting there I'm getting there. But anyway, on today's agenda, we are going to Target. Um, we're gonna go to the bookstore. We might grab a bite to eat and just enjoy this beautiful Saturday, guys, because it is beautiful outside. It's not hot and of course it's not cold, but it's like the perfect temperature. But anyway, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit that bell. Don't forget to hit that bell, y'all. Don't forget to hit that bell, okay? Hit that bell so you don't miss out on any of my new videos. And 
and yeah guys that is the vibe for today for tomorrow i'm just going to do some cleaning uh cooking getting myself together for the week ahead you know just pretty much a sunday reset so guys we are about to go outside we outside today hey hey we outside today is that how the song go i'm going to target bookstore getting some lunch and enjoying the day guys so <laughs> y'all already know the vibes y'all know the Fleming family we, we turn out but anyway I will catch up with you guys afterwards and maybe I'll do a little haul show you guys what I got from Target what we got from the bookstore oh and guess what my wig came today my wig came today so I'm gonna show you guys that too but anyway I'll catch up with you guys later <laughs> home we made it back i had to eat real quick because y'all i was starving so i had got food from panda express i didn't get anything but you know rice i had tried the fire shrimp and i had got the black angus pepper steak meat i forgot what it's called but yeah we are home now we went to all the places that i said we were going and we're finally back home i'm going to show you guys everything that we got today which was quite a few things all right so from Target. So I got the kids some more vitamins because they ran out of vitamins. So I got them some more vitamins. I also got another multi-surface cleaner from Mrs. Myers. I love the scent of fall leaves, guys. I love this scent. And I also love, um, what is it? I think it's, um, I forgot what it's called. I want to say pumpkin. No, it's not nothing pumpkin. It's not nothing pumpkin, but I forgot the other scent that I like, but I'll put it somewhere here on the screen of the one that I really, really do like. 
I just haven't seen it in stores um, anymore, but I really, really, really like that one as well. Like that's the best one thus far that I've enjoyed from Mrs. Myers. I also got some finger toothbrushes for Luffy because I need to brush his teeth. And I usually make his toothpaste, coconut oil, baking soda, and water. And that's how I make his toothpaste. So I got these for Luffy. And also from Target, I got these little skeleton jars, guys. These are skeletons. And I got these jars because every Halloween, the kids and I make potion, guys. We make like this magic potion for daddy to drink. So the kids put like all of this nasty stuff together. I mean, nothing that he can't eat. Pieces of bread, maybe milk, what else? Candy, maybe syrup, a smashed banana, maybe a strawberry, a grape, and um, peanut butter, you know, mayonnaise, Miracle Whip, anything you can find in your fridge. They put it all in whatever jar that I buy them. They put all the ingredients together and give it to their dad for him to drink the potion. So guys, if you have kids, even if you don't have kids and you want to do something fun, pick on your husband, pick on your boyfriend, hell, pick on your girlfriend. Make a potion, guys, and give them the potion to drink. All healthy things, not even just healthy things, but anything that you can eat. Put it all in a jar and give it to them and see if they'll drink it. Um, my husband, he he ain't with it. Like he'll smell it first. Most of the time, Raymond will fake the funk, okay? He will act like he drunk the potion for Halloween. So I got these two jars and they were in the dollar section. Yeah, they were three bucks. I don't know if you could see it, but yeah. Both were $3 from the dollar section. So I got these. And then the main thing that I went and got from Target are towels, guys. A whole bunch of towels. So I got black, we got the black and white pinstripe towels, the gray and white pinstripe towels, and then we got the beige and white towels. I have all these big towels here, and then I got a whole bunch of little ones. This pack, this pack, this pack, and this pack. So. All these towels I got here. So the kids got their costumes from Party City. I'm going to show you their costumes. So Raymond wanted to be an illusion ghost. I think that's what it's called. Some type of ghost. But this is what he wanted to be for Halloween. And then Sassy is going to be a dark countess. She's going to be this spider woman thingy, I guess. But this is her costume. This is what Stice is going to be for Halloween. And of course, I'm going to, you know, make her face up, put on her little, you know, makeup. I'm going to get her right into character. So this is Stassi's, uh costume. We can't forget about Luffy, right? This is like a little hat, guys. I'm going to put him on this little hat and then he has this little outfit with like the little the shingles at the bottom it's gonna cha 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 ah ah cha 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 ah ah cha 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 i thought this was so cute but this is his halloween costume because we cannot leave him out he is a part of our family and he is going to be dressed up with the kids for halloween so when I take the kids trick-or-treating, this is going to be his costume. And Stassi and Ramon are going to have on their costume as well, too. Cha-cha-cha. <laughs> we got the kids, you know, some trick-or-treat bags. Let me show you guys what we got from Barnes & Nobles. I haven't been to Barnes & Nobles in so long. Like, they even have a Starbucks in Barnes & Nobles. A whole vibe, guys. Like, a whole vibe in Barnes & Nobles. But yeah, I haven't been in a while, but... We went today, we got us a couple of books because we are trying to get back on our book journey. We're trying to get back in the habit of reading a book a month, like reading a brand new book each month just to get that habit back up and going. This is my son's book, The Bad Guys. My son, he is into like comic books real bad. He has the whole Dogman collection. I'll show you guys that too as well. But he does have the whole Dogman collection, like every single Dogman book that came out. He has it, so we made him get something else this time, and he has The Bad Guys by Erin Blably. Blobly. My daughter, we got her Itty Bitty Princess Kitty, which is a cute little book for her. 
We're trying to get the kids to get chapter books um, right now. I don't want them reading any books that are super, super easy. I'm trying to get them into, you know, reading chapter books. My daughter is in second grade and my son is in fourth grade. So yeah, that's Aussie's book and that is Ramon's book. My husband had got JGZ Jenkins' book, Adversity for Sale. I know my husband was really talking about this book and he was like, he really, really wanted this. So he found it today and got it. And I want to read this too. So after he gets done reading this, I think I'm going to read this as well to see what GZ is talking about. Because he did just get a divorce. I don't know if he got the divorce yet, but I know he is getting a divorce from, I think her name is Jenny. Yeah, he's divorcing Jenny. How dare you? Why are you divorcing her, okay? Why are you divorcing her? Why? Maybe it's in the book. Maybe his reason is in, in this book, but I don't know. But anyway, I'm just talking stuff, y'all. I'm just talking crazy, but yeah, this is my husband's book, Adversity for Sale. That's what he got. Um, my son also got Stick Dog. So he has two books, Stick Dog. And then for me, I went ahead and got The Housemaid by Frida. Because y'all are pumping this book up. I believe it been came out like a year ago, I think. Y'all are all over TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, talking about The Housemaid. So I got it today. I'm going to check it out um, probably tomorrow. I may start reading this tomorrow because I just finished Atomic Habit. Best book ever. If you want to change your mindset, if you want to change your habits, create good habits, just doing all things that'll make you a better person overall, you need to read that book, Atomic Habits. It's a great book. The Housemaid, I'm reading you tomorrow so we're gonna get into this book tomorrow so these are all the books we got from Barnes and Nobles we'll be back in there next month to get a new book and we're gonna try to pick up a new read every month so that's what we got from Barnes and Nobles also guys my wig came my wig is here guys you know what I'm gonna show you guys the wig tomorrow so that is it guys that's what i got from target from um barnes and nobles from party city those are all the things that we got today so i did get my wig in i got my wig from eunice it came in the mail today and i'm super excited i will show you guys that tomorrow because of course my camera is about to die and tomorrow is going to be like a real chill and fun day we're going to do some cooking a little bit of cleaning the kids and i are going to make donuts tomorrow so that is going to be fun and yeah we're going to do all the things tomorrow so i'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs> Happy Sunday. Happy October 8th. I have a bunch of things to do. Last night my camera was dying so I couldn't continue the video. Plus I was tired. But I'm back today and we are about to get right back into all the things again. But let me show you guys the wig. So this is the box. It's like a little red box. So I don't believe I need to do any more plucking in the front because it look real. Like it looked really, really, really realistic. And they bleached the knots. 
it looks like because it's brown it's a little brown so i believe they bleached the knots i forgot what length i got but it's it's pretty long it's not that long but it's long it's long enough for me i don't like really really long long hair it has an elastic band in the inside um, so i could adjust it to my liking and it also has combs Yeah, it has cones inside, so that's nice, but... Whoa, look at these lashes. Uh, they're cute, but y'all know me. I'm pretty basic. These lashes are too long for my liking, so yeah. But they sent me some lashes. Um, they sent me, I think this is like an edge band. You put this on your edges to keep your edges down, I guess. Y'all know. Look, look here, y'all. I don't wear wigs, so really, I don't know what this is for, but I believe you put this on your edges so they can stay um, laid, right? I don't know, but I got this, and then they sent me a wig cap. Yeah, I don't know what this is either, guys. Maybe a mirror? Yeah, maybe it's a mirror, because I can see myself, but yeah guys and i got this so i will be putting her on this weekend but anyway guys so now i am about to get luffy a bath and i'm also going to brush his teeth because he really needs a bath and he really needs his teeth brushed he needs his tongue brushed he needs all that done he's actually going to get groomed next weekend but i need to give him a bath now until it's time for him to go to his appointment so yeah i'm going to give luffy a bath and brush his teeth ramon is going to blow dry him and put on his oil and all that good stuff and then after that i'm going to throw these towels in the washer give them a good wash to dry them put them away and let's get into this day <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 